Hey guys, Runnerman15 here, and today, welcome to episode 2 of playing every single Steam game in my library. My library is currently at 433 games. I added these two games um, before I finished the last episode, but I just decided not to uh, include them because I had already gone down. So we're not going to include these games. I played a little bit of these games either way, and I think they're kind of... I don't know, I didn't like them, so... I figured we'd just keep going down and uh, just not worry about them, you know? So the next game on our Steam library that we're going to be playing today is a game called Alone in the War, which I'm pretty sure I got this from a random Steam key thing from like G2A or something. And you can kind of tell, I mean, it costs 10 bucks, which is uh, way too overpriced in my opinion, but you can, you can tell... Yeah, very uh, intriguing gameplay here. There's three user reviews. And the description says, In this isometric shooter, you are the only agent left to destroy an entire army of soldiers. Get your weapon and get ready to shoot anyone in your way. So we can see the uh, th two reviews here. Has potential, but so far unfinished. If you're going to play it now, don't play the second map yet. And then, you know, bad review. Obviously, this game hasn't been worked on in a while. If we go to the community hub and we go to uh, news, bug fix on level on level eight. That was three years ago. Wow, so many updates. So yeah, you know, just a crappy game. Might be a little cash grab. I've never played this game before because I knew it was kind of crap. So uh, we're just gonna see what the game looks like. Let's see input. Okay, let's play. Made with Unity. You know it's gonna be good. Oh my. That is loud. Uh, so it looks like we have level one and shop. Ooh. Ooh. What is that noise? <laughs> what is that? It is very great. Very great sound effects. Move is WASD, aim is right mouse button. Shoot left mouse button, reload is R. Map zoom is E, I didn't get to uh... Okay, well, we got some coins. And sprint here, oh, nah. Yo, yo, reload. Yo, bro, surviving all my bullets. Holy cow. It took like three mags to kill. There's more gold over here. Get him. Bro, he's gonna kill me. Bro, reload. These enemies have so much health. I have to kill 10 of them? The music is so loud. Holy cow. And the graphics quality don't look that bad. I mean, it looks like a Unity game. It looks like a little mobile game. So uh, there's that, I guess. I don't know if this is what you would call fun. But, eh, you know, whatever. Is there like a way we can heal? There's no menu. Okay, reload. There we go. Look how many mags I have. 99,000? I guess I ain't ever running out of ammo. Okay, two more enemies left. Alright, one dude left and he's in the very middle. Gotta go get him. I'm stuck. Oh no, never mind, we're good. It's funny how they all have knives. Well, that dude doesn't have a knife. What the hell does that dude have? Is he holding the knife upside down? Is it like sticking out of his... He's not even holding it correctly. Wow. Level complete. Ooh, good music, bro. So this is weapon upgrade. Let's upgrade the uh, damage. Eh, reload time, you yeah. know. Let's go to the next level. Let me guess, this is gonna be more of the same... Wait, wait. Crouch? Change weapon? Evade? 
I can nade people. That's kind of cool. I didn't know that. A shotgun, a rifle, and a pistol. But these don't have any bullets, so we gotta use the pistol. We can kill in one mag now, that's cool. So I'm assuming we just go around the map and shoot at people. Maybe the game gets like increasingly harder as time goes on, I don't know. I think that's uh, about all, uh, all we're gonna get from this game. I think it's funny that they have knives and I have like three, four weapons and nades too. Like, hmm, yes, I'm gonna slowly walk towards you while holding a knife. Wait, wait, let me get the gold first. I'm stuck. I need more bullets. I need more bullets. You have stamina? Oh, you have stamina, bro. Bro, you don't even run. You run like 10% faster when you sprint. And they had the audacity to put a stamina bar in this game. That's crazy. You know what? I'm not gonna lie. The game has been running pretty smooth. Uh, the person in the reviews said uh, this was like a cash grab game with just a bunch of uh, with just a bunch of free assets or something. I'm not gonna lie. This could work as a mobile game. Feels free and just loaded like ads and uh, in-app purchases. This might actually be a top charting mobile game. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, but for ten dollars, this game is definitely not worth it. Oh, I got an achievement. Finish a level without being hit. Oh, look at that, I'm already getting a achievement. Do we only have two levels? What? No way we only have two levels. Hold up, what's, uh, what are the achievements? Grade all stats, finish all game levels. Bro, there's only two levels. Grade all stats for the shotgun, all stats for the rifle. Can you even do these achievements? Look, I'm just playing the same level over and over again, because I am. Hold up, I want to see if there's more than just two levels. Oh yeah, there's different levels. Look at that. Now there's 13 guys. Dude, I might actually be able to complete the whole game. I might be able to 100% this game. I'm not gonna lie, this game isn't as bad as I thought it would be. I thought this game was gonna be a lot worse. It's actually not that bad. It's a little boring. It gets a little old, but honestly, like, if you were to get this game for free or get it for, like, you know, maybe you bought a random Steam key bundle or something and you got it, it, it might, uh, might keep you, uh, entertained for a little bit. Actually, this would work good on the Steam Deck. So you could actually legitimately make this a mobile game. You just play it on the Steam Deck, but I don't have a Steam Deck, so I can't test it out. All right, that wasn't that bad. Oh yeah, now I have another level. Wait, what? Okay, I have no clue what's going on, but uh, yeah, let's go ahead and move on to the next game. Let me know down in the comments below if you think I should 100% uh, this game. Alrighty, the next game today that we're going to be playing is called Alpaca Stacka. So as you can see, we just played Alone in the War. Now it's time for Alpaca Stacka. And as you can also see, I have six out of six achievements. I've already played this game. Uh, it's a pretty short game. So Alpaca Stacka is a 3D adventure platformer where you play as a kind alpaca dedicated to helping their animal friends. So pretty much in this game, you know, you talk to this chicken and you have to go around, you have to save her uh, little chicks. You just go around the map collecting them and stuff. So it's a very short game. It's only about 10 minutes long. So we might as well play it again for today. But I originally was going to do a little YouTube video on this game a long, uh, quite a while ago. Uh, but when I recorded it, I had no audio. There was no game audio. So I just scrapped the video. Made with Unity. Second game made with Unity on this video. But this game's actually good. Let's see, any, uh, there's no graphic options. One day, Paz the alpaca went to visit Mama Hen for a party. At her farm, Paz met her children, Chirpy, Chase, Cherry, Cheryl, and Choco. They were all about to party when Streusel the squirrel appeared. Out of jealousy, Streusel set Mama Hen's chicks on the loose and disappeared. Now Paz must help Mama Hen by bringing all her chicks safely home. Alright. Let's go talk to you. All my children aren't back in the fence yet. Why would Streusel let them loose? Was he jealous? Oh, who knows what could happen to my children. 
Chirpy could get lost looking for a place to sing. Chase could tire himself out from running around. Cherry and Cheryl might eat too many red apples. Choco or Coco, whatever, might get stuck in some mud. Oh, Paz, please help me find my children as soon as possible. All right, so we got to go find these fools. You can see there's a squirrel right there. You can man with right click. So find Chirpy singing somewhere. Oh, we have directional audio. I must use it. Shift, left shift is to sprint. Obviously space is to jump. There we go. Ho, 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 mud. Love mud. They love mud, you guys. Alright, get back in there. There's like little tutorial signs and stuff, but you know, I already know how to play the game. I know there's a dude in this grass. There's a there's a chick over here somewhere. Right here. Eh. Wow, you're so fast, Kaz. But I bet you can't catch me again. Wait, I pressed E though. Huff, that was lucky, but I'm the fastest around. Hey. Get your butt back here. Huff Puff Wheeze. You're really fast. Takes a deep breath. Phew, that was fun. Maybe when I grow bigger, we can race. And then I'll win. For now, I could use a ride home. Okay, we can carry multiple chickens. Uh, so we need to find the other chickens. Do some parkour. Ooh, parkour, parkour. Oh, ooh, made it. Hi, Pabs. Did you hear my song for Mama? I can't wait to sing it for her. This. All right, where's... Uh, we need the two apple ears. I think they're at that big apple tree up there. I'm not going to lie. In my first playthrough of this game, I did mess up some of those uh, mushroom jumps. Dude, that dude almost got out. Let's eat a shake trees. There you are. Burp. Woo, that was a lot of apples. Cherry and I were having an eating contest. I ate 103 apples. I think I won, but at what cost? I need a ride. Burp home. All right, let's go return them back. the only oh no 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 i see another red apple tree yeah you can see all the freaking half-eaten apples on the ground yo get your butt over here oof it's pets i'm glad you found me cheryl and i are in an apple eating contest i ate 24 i bet i won can you take me back home i'm going to rub it in her face yeah no she she beat you bro she ate, like, quintuple that amount. Alright, there you go. All the chicks are back in the fence. After returning all of the chicks home, Mama Hen was relieved, and then the chicks thanked Paz for all the fun. Strusel saw that they were even happier than before and felt more lonely. Mama Hen saw Strusel and instead of turning him away, invited him to join the rest of the party. Just like that, Paz, Mama Hen, and her chicks, and Strusel, all got to celebrate the day together. There you go, and that's the game. So, I just did it in eight minutes. Nine minutes, eight minutes. So, yeah, it's all Pekka Seka. Uh, it's free game, so, you know, I didn't pay for it. To be honest, I'd say it was worth money. It was worth a good, like, three, four dollars, you know? Maybe play it you get some fun out of it you know yeah other than that you know it's a cool game it's super easy to do all of the achievements you literally just did what i just did you know so yeah if you guys want to check this game out it's free it's playable on both mac and windows even if you have a, like a potato school chromebook you can probably play this game well, maybe not a chromebook but you know crappy computer play this game you know great game i recommend it i'll give that game like uh eight and a half out of ten Alrighty, the next game on our Steam library here is a game called Altitude. Um, Creatures is also a free game. 
It's also a free game. Altitude is kind of like, uh, it says, this is the description right there. So about this game, blast your way across the cartoon skies in this fast-paced game of aerial combat. Nimbly Games has created, has crafted an instantly accessible, rewardingly deep, and ravishingly -ly 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 fun multiplayer action game. The sirens have sounded. Bogies are coming in hot. It, it kind of looks like, it reminds me of like a browser game. That's why I first bought it. Or not, I didn't buy it, but you know, that's why I, I got it in the first place. I downloaded it. The first time I ever downloaded it, which, you know, I don't really remember the first time I downloaded it, but, but I, I didn't play very much of it. We're going to play a little bit of Altitude. Uh, this should be, last update was uh, over a year ago, so I don't think they're working on the game anymore. I'm surprised the last update was only a year ago. Nimbly Games. I have no cursor. Um, and OBS is not showing anything on the screen. There we go. Now you can see the screen. Yeah. Okay. Turn those graphics up. Yeah. All right. That'll work. All right. Okay. Okay. Let me turn the, uh, so I can hear myself. Holy. All right. So let's go into some training and learn how to fly. It's been a while since I played this game. Follow the path with your mouse or use the left and right arrow keys to turn your plane. Gamepad is also supported. Well, snap. Let me plug in a controller real quick. Hold up. Yo, dog. I don't think controller is supported. Registering something. So I guess we have, like, multiple different guns we can use. That's like a EMP. It's like our normal... You see, it has like a little recharge. What does B do? Nothing. Try. Uh, try. That's a boost. Speed. It's triggers. That's uh. Scoreboard. Ace the next path, and we'll move on to combat. I think I get the the gist. Not that difficult. Play a free for all. Blood has nukes, bro. Oh my god, they're gonna kill me, bro. Dude, I'm murking these bots, bro. How do I use my, uh, my power of, what is it, triangle? Oh, it's B, okay. All right, anyways, the whole point of the game isn't to play against bots. The whole point of the game is to play against other people. One person. One person, bro. Damn, dude, there's only one person playing this game? Must be level 21 or higher. You were level five. It was bots. So I guess we're playing against bots. gonna go attack the other base, I guess. Damn, I got insta -murked. This is uh, intriguing gameplay, right, guys? Uh, I don't know what else to say about this game. I mean, it's a plain game, so there you go. I'm guessing we take this to the other side of the map. Yeah, I don't think that worked out. There we go. Bombed base, 31 damage. That's a rocket. I think he's gonna bomb my base. Oh, we got shot down. All right, one more bomb and I win the game. I missed. I'm gonna hurry and take this over there before he, for the bot. I got it. Let's go. Too good. Uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's altitude. Um, I guess I, I could have gone into, like, 
plane customization and stuff because i'm sure there's customization for the plane but like no one's playing the game so dead game unfortunately that's why you know it hasn't been updated in a year anyways uh yeah that's all i gotta say about altitude kind of a cool game kind of a cool concept might be fun for some people but you know like i said unfortunately there's no players so yeah let's move on to the next game all right the next game on our list is a game called america's army proving ground so this is a fps game made by the u.s army yeah i guess when gaming was getting big they made a video game to try and recruit players to the army america's army proving grounds is the official game of the u.s army and part of the highly acclaimed america's army game series this free military game focuses on small unit tactical maneuvers and puts you to the test in a wide variety of new america's army maps and double a fan favorites can't really complain much about it i'm not gonna lie i have played this game before i've played it on playstation i have played it on pc as well yeah pretty sure this game is dead i'm not sure if they still run the servers for this game let's let's check the news last patch notes was last year final version the best it can be so i guess let's just jump straight into it you know like i said let's see host the server launch an editor i guess they have like a map editor i don't know we just want to play the normal game uh, like i said it's supposed to be kind of like a tactical fps game you know some, something like uh, rainbow six siege kind of but i guess a little bit more tactical i don't know last time i played this game it was like super funky look at that they got their own custom little launcher okay okay I'm not gonna be playing this with a controller Ooh yeah uh access granted this is not full screen no frame rate smoothing 62 max frames go 144 all right other than that i think there, there there is a training mode all right let's play the tutorial mm, propaganda i love propaganda is this when they're trying to recruit people to uh wow find your warrior go army wait we're in the game the game looks kind of kind of reminds me of like a source game do they have a uh, FOV slider or no? I have a feeling there's no FOV slider. All right, well, I guess we'll just walk this way. F to use. This is our gun. Whenever you're ready, twinkle, toes. twinkle Toes? Did you just call me Twinkle Toes? Hold up. You can lean in this game. So, like I said, rainbow. So, C is to crouch. We can slide, too. X is the prone, we can dolphin dive as well. What? Hold on, can I? What? Who's that? See my hands? I can dolphin dive, or I can uh, drop shot. And climb. Sure, yeah. You know, I'm not gonna lie, for a game that's free and that came out, but it came out in 2015, but. F to climb? What the heck? For a game that came out. For free from the army? I mean, it doesn't look that bad. First. The heck. Bro, can you stop? Can you shut up? There's a reload animation. Damn. Oh wow. That is a interesting zoom level. 
go. I need to go back to aim labs. Do I hold my breath? Space bar? Put away your weapon when you sprint, so you gotta come out of sprint to uh, shoot your gun, which is uh, interesting, but you know. Dog, I looked. He was not up. He came up after I shot him. Fiddle with the radio like you're stealing intel. Revive. Wow. Great revive. I just revived his butt. Firing range. And then I'm pretty sure firing range. Oh my lord. Drones. Helicopters. Jeez! Night vision goggles! It's just like Call of Duty. Check out the range. Got some uh, various weapons. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. M14? Sound effects are cool, that's for sure. Reload animation is always cool. Do you have a 1911 this game? That isn't a 1911. This is. Super cool with the reload animation, so. Gotta admit, different reload animations for uh, when it's full and when it's empty. You know, this game, this game's pretty cool, bro. Like, you know, it seems like a good concept. Oh, yeah, look at that shotgun, bro. Holy cow. Sniper? Oh, wow. Here we go. All right, let's jump. Oh, look at the scope detail, though. Crazy, dude. You can tell, like, a lot of thought and detail was put into this game. Obviously, it never, you know, never kicked off. It wasn't anything crazy. And I think the game is dead. I could be wrong, though. Holy cow, there's people. There are people. Hold up. Wow, there's a lot of people. There's actually Dallas inner only. Yeah, they got, uh, they got servers, bro. The Italian division. Danish war pigs. There's actually people playing it. Uh, I guess this game isn't dead. Not yet, anyways. The, uh, oh, we're connecting. Extract, 12v12. Uh, just auto-pick. I think it's a spectate here. What is it? It's just sniper warfare? Is that all it is? Third right cap, third right cap. Oh, we got callouts too. Like, legit callouts, bro. Bro has a weapon skin, do you see that? Yo, Blood got a weapon skin on his gun. Oh, Ew. oh they're going. You better watch out, bro. Beautiful smoke, you can get the res? You can hit the res. Oh, he got naded though. Still alive. Ooh. Like he got naded himself. You can change your firing mode? Hold up. Controls, mode left alt. Middle mouse is a change firing mode. Oh, he got sniped, bro. Oh, damn. So I got a dude all the way back and their spawn. 
You see him, you see him, you see him. He's right in front of you. I just saw him. No way. Going for the res? Look at that res distance, bro. Shoot him. Well, what is that reaction time, bro? I think they're good. They can just go to the flag. Oh. Ooh, bad aim. Nice. All right, so we're going to go with the... With a scar. M68. We'll go uh, M17. Do frags. And we'll do some smokes. All right, let's push forward here. Now I got to use the scar, bro. I'm going to crawl forward here. We crawl pretty fast, so. Yo, that frag was terrible, bro. I'm not going to lie with you. You do not throw frags very far. Second left. I can't even see anyone, so I have no clue if I'm shooting at anyone. Push forward a little bit. Had some cover fire here. Behind a head glitch. Watch these top windows. Push forward a little bit here. Come on. You can close it still one. What is that voice, bro? Whose blood I think he's talking to? Can we push them back from the bridge? Oh, oh, oh. whoa! Uh, See if I can actually get a kill here. Yeah. Oh shit, that dude got. Oh my god. I almost died. Almost uh, insta killed, bro. Mantle over this? No, I need health, bro. I have one HP. If I get shot. I want to res you guys, but... Damn. I naded, bro. Still alive. Like one dude, maybe? <laughs> yeah. Alright, well, uh, that's uh, American Army's Proving Grounds. It's not everything you can do in-game, but... You know, it's a tactical shooter. I guess you can customize your soldier, you know. So change what gun you have there's there's a few guns in this game there's not a lot you can see there's ak 107 so nothing crazy change your camo and stuff kind of a cool game i'm surprised that there's actually legitimate people playing this game i didn't think there would actually be people playing this game still but yeah all right well let's go ahead and move on to the next game all right, the next game on our list is a game called Anomaly Zone. Now, Anomaly Zone, I'm pretty sure is kind of like a survival game. Uh, and this game does not have a store a store page anymore. It has been unlisted from the Steam uh, store page. So if we go here, you know, there's no icon. There's some like community content. That's it. There's trading cards for it. 15 trading cards. Holy moly. If we click store page. Yeah, so I have no clue really what this game is you see i have like 13 minutes played the last time i played it was four years ago so you know i don't really remember this game i don't know if it'll work i don't know if we'll be able to play yeah i think that's a sign that we're not gonna be able to play anomaly Mali zone obviously oh hello what happened why uh maybe they have a new uh, steam page where okay i'm gonna go ahead and add this to my library that means maybe this anomaly zone is outdated maybe they made a new steam page uh so let's go ahead and uh, uninstall this game yeah you can see there's two anomaly zones and they're the same game well i'll go ahead and install this we're gonna have to wait for this to install uh but now we can actually see what this game's about anomaly zone is an open world mmorpg and a post apocalyptic shooter be a scientist a soldier a hunter or an engineer Explore anomalous territories, search for artifacts, fight mutants, and other players. Participate in mass PvP and PvE battles. The zone is waiting. So, yeah. Looks like it's, you know, your run-of-the-mill zombie survival game. Or uh, survival game with, like, monsters and stuff. But at least we have an actual Steam page. Rated mixed. Game is a relaunch of an older game. We'll say it's pay to win with the DLC starter kit. What is that? ominous ass music bro the poor man stalker online game okay well people saying it's uh copy paste i mean it is a free 
survival game. And uh, when's the last time they uh, did anything to this game? Because they've just been hosting events. Have they even updated the game? Low key, I don't think they've updated the game in a very long time. But hey, I guess they keep the game alive with events, even though it looks like it's the same exact event over and over again. Like the same few events over and over again. All right, let's actually play this game now. Let's see, will it launch? Uh, oh. Launch something. Launching. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh. 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 Let's try that again. Oh, oh. It tried. It tried its best. I think it's trying to launch full screen. Oh, okay. Uh, except, yes. EU? Uh oh. All right. Let's go to the PVE server. I guess I already had a, a person. Origin alien. Oh, let's make a new person. Wait, a new stalker? be a female or a male i am a male native alien locals name the stalkers who illegally enter the territory of the zone oh yes billy bob invalid characters can't keep up alone join a clam Testing, testing, you don't have to answer. Any returning signal will be muffled by the anonymous, the enamel, blah, 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 blah. but I can see you. Or the satellite cameras. If you get this message, make a few steps using the water keys. First steps, talk to blacksmith. Tell him that the train won't arrive. I'm assuming it's the blacksmith. Yeah, I understood that, my guy. Oh. Uh, fresh blood, first time in zone? I guess you could say that. But just know, nobody is going to pamper you. Ah, this is not a Russian accent. No one is going to pamper you here. One does what one must to survive. You're going to feed and clothe yourself. Everyone is working very hard here. Blah, blah, blah. First steps, talk to the blacksmith. You know how to have a handle a weapon, right? Using inventory? Okay. This is legitimately a stalker game. Like, actually. <laughs> this is literally stalker, bro. All right, let me talk to this fool again, I guess. Let me, let's go back into third person. Uh, your father hasn't whipped you enough? Okay, I talked to the blacksmith, and uh, well, let's go pick up the rifle, I guess. Oh, there we go. Brownie, I am all ears. Got a bunch of new quests now. Hello? Pick up the rifle? Where's the rifle at? Oh, bro, who am I supposed to talk to here? Uh, be a warrior. Oh, warrior, defender. Okay. Who's this? Former stalker? Do I have a coin? You have coin. Not enough money. So, like, I'm trying to talk to the blacksmith, and uh, blood is not letting me. Uh, blood is not letting me talk to him. I need to find one of the other people, I guess. Oh, there we go. Okay. 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 I mean, this game seems uh, interesting. Lots of reading involved, that's for sure. Uh, not sure what rifle I'm supposed to pick up and where I'm supposed to pick it up. Uh, the game won't let me talk to the blacksmith again, so. Over here to Brownie. What job are you offering? Find some toys. Um, Arthur. Oh, Arthur. All right, I'm gonna go like run and look for things to kill uh because this game is uh kind of jank and i've already played stalker games before so why can't i Dude, where's my gun here we go can i shoot these rats Build small rat mr tail what's in here oh what the fudge Okay. What the heck, bro? What are those? I uh, never really played any of the Stalker games, so, you know, I'm not the biggest uh, Stalker fan because just, you know, I never really played any of them. I played more Metro games than I have Stalker games, so. Like, no ammo. Assault rifle. Let's go get the. Let's go get the AR. I guess that's where the rifle is. We'll go pick that up. So I guess that's one of the quests. How was that noise, bro? Yo. 
Low key, don't think there's any ARs around here, bro. Oh, there's the gun. Marvel is broken. You need to talk to the blacksmith. Assuming you're not the blacksmith. Yeah, you're brownie. Can I sell the stuff in my inventory for, like, money? That's something I can do? Ah, fresh blood. First time in the zone? My rifle is broken. Where he left it? Look, it was jammed. It happens when you don't take care of your weapon properly. Show it to your, our repairman. Maybe you can do something about it. Also, go see the doctor, especially if a mutant happened to bite you. Better not to joke with such things. Safety above all. Okay, so we need to talk to a repairman. And also talk to the doctor. So we're going to go talk to the doctor because we got bit by a mutant. Reasonable, especially if you're in the zone. You neither have skill nor immunity yet. Okay. The medicines cost money. All right, let's go talk to the repairman, I guess. Is there a repairman in here somewhere? That looks like a repairman. Greetings, this rifle is broken. I can see that. Can you repair it? Because it can give it to me in case you need any maintenance in the future. Oh, for two types of service, the tire equipment repair and repair of particular items in your bag. By equipment, we mean everything that you're currently wearing. Okay. Repair, we open your inventory, point out what you repair. I don't have enough money. Right, let's go talk to the blacksmith again. Any other advices? You have to be aware of anomalies. Okay. Everyone is working here. It's not any choice. Choose your path. Okay, I already did that. I will be so I just keep the second in reserve. A weapon that has an ass to have it breaking down at the wrong moment. Okay. Okay. You know, talk to Koila the Sour, which is not you. Dude, where'd that AR go? Bro, it's my gun, dog. I also have no ammo, so like, I need more ammo. Do you have a spare gun? Black likes to talk. I do have one, but it's not spare, it's mine. I'll give you the pistol, no charge, but you need the adjust There are a lot of rats walking around the stage. Try the pistol on them. In exchange, I'll ask you to find two of my friends who went missing in the zone some time ago. If you ever meet stalkers called Mitka and Spit, help them and bring me some news from them. Without any radio communication, I start to worry about them. Agreed. Shoot the rats and talk to Sour. Okay, so we'll get this. Yo, I'm dragging and dropping and it's not doing crap, bro. I have to fill the mag or something? No. Your blood. It's not working. To reload the weapon, you need a magazine. To attach a magazine case to the weapon, put the weapon in your inventory and drag and drop the magazine case on the weapon. Maybe I have to be like outside. Go out here. Weapon is empty. Bro. Yoink. Yoink. Is this weapon like broken? You don't think it's repairable. Okay, I guess I'll just kill some rats then. Where the rats? They only take like one shot to kill. Yo, can I pull my gun out? This dude, this game is pretty buggy. I've noticed. Okay. Where's the last one? There, I killed all three. I guess let's go talk to Sour again. Alright, Mr. Sour. Build your rats. Looking for more ammo. I have some ammo. The poison ones. Crafters, okay. Several mutant dogs in the village. He's here and around the village. Bring me two heads as proof. Are you in? There will be a reward, of course, and the ammo we talked about. Alright, that's all I'm going to do for this video. As you can see, it's kind of, you know, if you're familiar with the Stalker game, it's basically just a copy-paste Stalker game. Uh, kind of a survival, you know, survival RPG game. That's like post-apocalyptic. I mean, it seems kind of cool, but if you guys want some actual content on this game, let me know down in the comments below. Always, if you guys want to see any, if you want to see a video, a separate video on any of the games that I showcase in the video, just put them down in the comments below. I'll check it out and maybe we'll make uh, just a separate video, maybe even a whole video series. So if you guys are interested in seeing uh, Anomaly Zone, uh, yeah, just let me know. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and move on to our last game. All right, and the last game for today's video is APB Reloaded. Now, if you don't know what APB Reloaded is, the world's first and premier action MMO third-person shooter allows you to choose between two sides of the law. Play as enforcer or criminal, customize your gear for the task at hand, and hit the streets and play how you want in a city filled with more action this side of Hollywood blockbuster. GTA clone. That's literally what it is. It's just GTA free, and it's kind of a funky game. I'm not gonna lie. I played a little bit of it. Played a little over an hour, and uh, it's kind of whatever. I guess they uh, they're still updating the game. As you can see, if we go to news, 
they're still updating it so maintenance announcement they do maintenance patch notes sale maintenance maintenance not i mean it's like not super often but you know the game is still being updated so there's that their game the game still has some players significant surprisingly uh what is this with the download more Bro, okay i'll be back once this finishes downloading all right after like 10 years it finally downloaded so let's uh let's actually play this game now easy anti-cheat what the hell i remember there being easy anti-cheat for this piece of crap game bro 64 bit update oh my gosh it means your game can you work uh, i just want to know how it feels you know realizing that you're trapped in a situation where you're just losing control of the city that's a matter of opinion opinion yeah there's your opinion and then there's the truth okay anyway there's a little intro to the game blah 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 blah, blah. no one cares about that so this is uh Fortnite GTA version. Of course, there's like custom cars and stuff. You know, you already know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scroll, like, sell my soul to Little Orbit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I want settings. Maximum quality. Turn that off. What the hell? Max anti-aliasing. Still looks funky. Next. All right, I already have a character. I've actually spent money on this game, surprisingly. So we're gonna connect to the district server. There's like different districts in this game. Uh, the reason I spent money on this game is because I needed a car uh, for one of my cars in different video games video. That's like the only reason I spent money on this game, but uh, it's gonna, you know, load, load into the financial district, blah, blah, blah. I never really learned how to play this game, low key. Uh, we can spawn here. So, you know, I'm a cop. My face is kind of messed up. I have, uh, n like, no money. So who can I go to for quests? Okay. Daily activity. First up, so never progress if you don't finish mission. Finish mission, I'll give you a word. Right. Start a mission. Oh, yeah. T. Start a mission. Once you're ready, you look for any uh, group. Oh, wait. How do I start a mission? What? I guess we have to start a mission. So this is uh, the game. I can, uh, you know, steal cars and stuff. Interact with the uh, NPCs. Did you call me? You wanna die? Um, you can steal cars and stuff. Oh, changed already. K. Just because I used to be one of them doesn't mean I want to do them any favors. Okay, so we gotta go to the checkpoint, I guess. So you know, let's go over here. Try not to run anyone over. So this game is, you know, supposed to be like an MMO game. Uh, so the enemies you're going to be going against are supposed to be like real people. But this game is uh, not as active as it used to be, obviously. There's not a lot of people who play this game anymore. So, you know, what the hell? Yo, that looked like a real person. All right, we got to shoot these guys down. Yo, hey yo! Oh nah, they got the gats, bro. Oh, I'm being double teamed. Oh what? Holy cow, bro! Shot him like with half my mag. They didn't die. Usable up to oh. I'm like one. I got him. Swing or be swung. Swing or be swung. That is the name of the game. Garam, Garam! Holy moly, that scared me. I 
I don't have much ammo. It's the only problem. Damn, dude. Damn, she has a shotgun, bro. I was running out of ammo anyways. Dude, how am I being shot, bro? Damn. Rewards? I got some cash. Dude, I got a lot of money. Holy cow. Help out. Help in an objective. Bro, that's what I did. Did I not do that? Bro. All right, I guess we should go buy some more ammo because uh, I don't have that much. We need more bullets. We need more bullets. We need more bullets. Hey, what's up, shoddy? It's you again, bro. Do you want to get popped in the head? What's up, Ty Durant? What's up? What's up? Press F on any orange objective to activate it. Interesting. Uh, I did buy a car. I actually did buy a car. Uh, if I can pull that out. I got some guns. Or I got some cars, bro. Get a shotgun. Okay. Wrong. Wrong. Uh, there is a vehicle select somewhere. I'm just not sure exactly where. It's somewhere down here. Find the nearby the vehicle spawner. And spawn the vehicle in. Yes, okay, this is the car. The Newlander Pioneer. This is the car that I bought. I think I paid like five bucks for it. Until I cannot turn worth a crap. And I showcase this in the uh, the Dodge Dakota, not Dakota, Dodge Durango video. I showcase this car. I probably could have unlocked it without playing through the game, but, uh, you know. I didn't want to spend like 800 years trying to grind this game out for one car that I was going to record a minute worth of footage of. All right, well, uh, I kind of don't really want to play this game anymore. It's, you know, it's free GTA. That's pretty much what this game is. Free cops and robbers. If you guys want to check it out, if you guys want me to do uh, like a full video on this game, I will. I'm, I will. If you guys just, you know, just let me know down in the comments if you guys want to see that. Uh, but yeah, so that's APB Reloaded. I mean, it's kind of cool. You saw... You know, you can like buy cars and stuff, buy guns, buy ammo, buy armor and clothes and stuff. You can, you know, play against other real players and like shoot them and stuff. There's of course artifacting on that dude. He's turning green, you know, so still got lots of graphical bugs. I can shoot this lady right here. You know, I can kill these people even though I'm a cop, but yeah, uh, it's a APB reload. All right, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that like button. And if you want to see more Steam game videos, hit that subscribe button. This is a series. It will be ongoing, and I will not stop until I play every single game. So if you guys are excited to see the rest of the games, you know, hit that subscribe button. Hit the little bell notification icon. It'll let you know whenever I post a video so you guys don't miss out on any content. Other than that, I'm RunnerMan15, and I'll see you guys later.